What's good, Homo Squad? It's your boy, Homo Ziggy. We back here with music mayhem for y'all. And look, we got five little songs and such. I don't know why I threw up the double five. We got five songs, not ten, five. But either way, you already know we have to show love to all the nerdcore songs. And look, most of the times, it may not be the big ones that I always go for, but hey, if it wasn't for artists that if it wasn't for the underrated artists like what I'm about to react to right now, some of the biggest songs that you had in, some of the biggest songs in Nerdcore wouldn't go fire. And Cyphers too. It wouldn't be fire without them. So we just gonna go straight right into it. The first song we got is by the by the Rumble World, sorry. Rumble World people themselves. We got Sylvain. Sorry. Sil Yes, Sivade, sorry. God's the Don, Jamar Rose, with Back At It, from their album, Scarlet, the uh, Don't, hold on. I forgot what was that album. Yeah. <laughs> ah, it don't matter anyway. Y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. So, without further ado, let's get in the video. Shout out to Reese on the edit. Of course, and hey, shout out to the like I said with Reese, shout out to him. He just had a kid today. Well, not today when I saw the announcement. So, my boy, shout out to you. Mm. to your pupils like Makima when she does this whole thing and such I go again like this and she does that and such around to your pupils Time till I body them hard. Huh? Fuck with the team and my dogs at the ready put rounds to your pupils like Maki Mahal. Remind me of Luffy, how I went and got me a crew full of talent and knock him a hall. Yeah, bitch, I go dunk on me, Baka. I carry the stick for my nigga like Saka. You wouldn't have beast on the track in my head in the books. Don't summon like Aji the Haka. I hop in the game, nobody keep my head in the books. Like a what? Nigga like Saka, you wouldn't have beast on the track in my head in the books. Don't summon like Aji the Haka. I hop in the game, nobody controlling me. Put him in boxes. Just look at your roster. I'm selling the scene, but I'm lacking a father. I got it. Trying to raise the bar. Thanks. I was coming home from school doing takes in my mama's car. Hey, that just shows you the grind. <laughs> it, if this, if a bar like this don't show you that nigga, he's pop, he putting his mind in, coming from home to doing takes in your mama's car. Hey, you can't hate on a rapper for doing. You can't hate on a rapper for showing where they came from, showing what they started from to how they are now. And keep on going. Can't hate on that. I'm trying to raise the bar. I was coming home from school doing takes in my mom's car. What you know about that? Limits of my art. That was the start. Now I got hella fans that'll tap lyrics on their arms. I don't know shit on my story. Came up from nothing. I just wanted glory. And all the competition getting boring. I'm trying to get a mill before I'm 40. It's been a few days since I've been back. It's been a few weeks since I've been back. It's been a few years since I've been back. It's been a few years since I've been back. Hold up, God Z. Hold on. That, that's God Z, right? It has to be. But that ain't Jamar. Hold up, God Z. Let's go. Out of the galaxy. Battery. Oh. Mm. 
infinity. This niggas keep on. Nigga, breathe. Take a breath. Nigga been going crazy and shit. Take a breath, my nigga. Damn. Take a breath, my nigga. The big three in Rumble World. Been three back. Been three since I've been back. Lamar. You gotta move out the way because I promised that me and my team only space in the last one. They tried to heal it in the face, rearranging the game and discarding the waste. Got this thing on the wayside. Shoot at the guy with no playtime. Into the game and no such for the take my eye. Have my name getting passed through the great five days. Said Jamar gonna be great, but it takes time. So I'm taking my. They said Jamar gonna be great, but it takes time. Hey. Can't deny it. You can't deny him that. Because, I mean, let's face it. The years of Jamar being in this the nerdcore scene, he's been going crazy. Whether it's his songs or his features, man's been going crazy. So, and this is just him building up for everybody else too. Mm. Mm. My niggas be working in insomniacs. No sleep. Say that they ain't taking no sleeps, no breaks. Shout out to Rumble World doing their thing. Or stream their album, their collab album. I forgot what it was. I said it before, but what? Don the Scarlet Crown, something like that. Hopefully, surveyed one of y'all. Let me know which what was the name of it again, cause I remember y'all. Uh, it had to do something with Scarlet, so. But I can't remember what it was. Recently, and for no reason at all, I asked Mint Mobile's legal. What the heck? Sorry, <laughs> I don't know what was that. I was, oh, my hand clicked on the wrong damn thing. Team, if big wireless companies are allowed to. All right, here we go. Now we got Loop with Mir Blackwell, worst state. All right, thanks for sexy gutter. Right now I'm in the worst state Still the chill with a hurt mind in the worst shape Still yeah. me for the 25 on the first day Still gotta do a 9 to 5 and then my worst day Still yeah. yeah. putting in the day working to my 9 to 5 When I think it's dope, it's really hard not to climb the top He said it's every jerk and then my mom's house is hard to free I just wanna see you on my proper time See this kid out of line, wish you wasn't out of time Wish the one would come to give me strength when I went out of line Wish you could tell us when it's time to be a fighter time I'm still in my pain, it's not hard to fly right around I wish God didn't even give me to the next Hey. Now, Mir, if you see this, I wonder if that bar, that little bar right there, is for since Breton separated himself from the loop. Because if it is, that bar hits tough. I ain't gonna lie. If it is that bar, I must. I'm gonna wait till. You I'm not going to confirm it now, but until when you see this video, because I know I'm going to tag you in this and you're probably going to see this, but when you hear me, when that bar comes up about the Loft Brother, is it relating to Breton or is it just a general bar? Because if it is with the Breton situation, then that bar hits fire than <laughs> What? This like this. Why hasn't Mir been featured a lot? Cause I see that Dripstick is going crazy. Cause he's been on 
Swabity's Cypher. He's been on Mari's songs. He's been on Game Boy's most recent song, the freaking OG one. Like, and then re and then what I'm what I'm seeing that he's about to be on Ham's song that's coming up on Friday. Dripstick has been everywhere. Why hasn't Mayor been everywhere too? Mayor needs to be on everybody's song too. Like, come on now. Mayor ain't no slack in this shit. Come on. Black and white is all combined like a panda. The black and white and such. Because the panda has black and white colors. But hey, you always hear this shit saying that not everything is all black and white and such. But, oof. You're talking. Hey, you cannot tell. This is such a real song, right, nigga? This ain't even about the AM. To be honest, this ain't even a shit. I, I be t I be telling y'all that when it comes to some of these nerdcore songs, they be if you really if you get the aesthetic of all oh, oh just because it's anime or because they're anime rapper or such or nerdcore rapper, they just gonna talk about stuff that's like nerd culture and such. Nah, it, and that may be true, but at the same time, songs like. This songs like this can really speak to somebody. They come to bars too. Hey, shout out to Mir, man, cuz nigga, you cannot tell me that if that don't relate to you some way, somehow, something wrong. You need to tell me that a song like this doesn't relate. It's either it's not for you or you're not hearing right. We got next. We got next. Yep. Hold on, y'all. yo with a Yuchi Ichidori song, Feel Alive. And it's featuring Sh Shinki. Shout out to Shinki. Because he's always commenting on my videos. Bro, hope you see this. I know you will. You better see this. Or else, not me. Shout out to my other Caribbean brother. Shout out to the Grenade. Shout out to the Caribbean country of Grena. Grenada. Keep me 
be crazy. Not only is Chinky's Chinky featuring this, but Maguire feature on this because this have that same level of like getting to the heart type of feeling right there. Maguire would have been crazy on this. I'm just saying. Okay, that's Shinky, I can tell. Hold up, Shinky. You just gonna come in with that high note in there? Hold up. You just like. Record. Cursing my soul, I don't want it. Talking about Sukuna and such. But like I said, another one of these songs. In a way, it's kind of reflecting the same thing like with Mir. Ain't that such a crazy thing that with Mir talking about in my worst state and then this song feature, this song coming after it, feeling alive? Bro, if this, don't, if this is not like a piggyback off of that, I don't know what is. Telling y'all, I didn't do this out of... Maguire should have been on this. I ain't gonna lie. Hold on. Don't worry, I'm still here, y'all. Give me a second, y'all. Sorry about that, y'all. All right, but yeah, like I was trying to say, well, my phone interrupted me. Well, not interrupting, but you know what I mean. This is, like I said, this is like a piggyback off of Mir's worst state song, and then this crazy. But Maguire would have been fire on this too, or at least have background vocals from him. Shout out to Shinki and Tsuyo. Tsuyo. Now we got Delta D's on touch slime is yeah. Okay. Um look. What I find out that I'm peak the ground keep always out here trying to hide what I see. But y'all time while I'm climbing heights, the mountains they reach. She call me high time, flood the streets round in the week. Within my time. Hold up, hold the heck up, nigga. You didn't have to come in with that song. I didn't even expect that sauciness. Run that back. I had to readjust myself because after them two songs with Mir and Tutsio, where it's like that can hit you in that heart and such, feeling emotional, this just came in here with a saucy vibe. Yeah, okay. Um, look. Let me adjust myself now. What I find out that I'm peak. The ground keep always out here trying to hide what I see. But y'all the time I'm climbing heights, the mountains they reach. She call me high tide, flood the streets, drown in the week. Within my timeline, I require thousands of seeds. It sounds unique. That even on an alien should bow with my feet. You spend mm. your whole life trying to be somebody you not. Bitch, I walk around proud to be me. I tell my hey. boys that I love them because I lost. 
us so many of them Whether they take different paths or worse when they've been taken from us Shit is fuck They love me out in New York like I'm from it You can find me with a fanny and a drink Two stepping in my yellows, man I ain't got that dog in me, they just dark shit Like I'm dead What it reminds me of? Hold on, let me see Use this beat Filthy Zach Sultan Hey, this beat is filthy this beat reminds me of Guilty, ain't you find me with a fit in a drink too stepping in my yellows, man. I got that dog in me, they just start shit. Make them dance when I snap, hey, this ain't important. I should be inducted, I belong with the marshes. I get high from painting pictures like I'm puffing them off. Damn, so baby, tell me where's the love? I'm the one that they let a hey hum, but they never say no. Shawty can't get enough. One touch might just make it on, might just make it on. Shawty tell me where the love. I'm the one that they let a hate haul, but don't ever say no. She can't get enough. I'm touching. 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 I'm these rappers looking for Bonnie like they was fly away from bitches who say that Bonnie wasn't the slide. Last half empty song, part some minute. Yeah, they told me life a bitch when we been fucking for a minute. Damn the coochie. Told me life was. Hold on. What you say? Run that back. What you say? Last half empty song, part some minute. Yeah, they told me life a bitch when we been fucking for a minute. That's a fine way I put it. Told me life was a bitch. Well, I will be. We've been. They told me life was a bitch. Where well, we was effing for a minute. <laughs> hey. Last half empty song, part some minute. Yeah, they tell me life a bitch when we been fucking for a minute. And the coochie so fine. What I tell her when I'm in it. Hey, you Uber outside. That's what I tell her when I'm finished. Awesome. Delta too saucy with it. I, I said it before and I'll say it again until y'all try to prove me wrong. Delta. And freaking black diamonds are two of the most sauciest nigga in Otaku in the world. <laughs> and if you have a problem with me saying that, fight me. What I tell her when I'm in it. That's what I tell her when I'm finished. All star player, give him 40 in a scrimmage. I be hard and glow, trying to a bag, watch me spin it. They ask me how I sleep at night, I'm such a piece of shit. I told her, baby, I prefer the silk sheets over linens on my So, baby, tell me where's the love? I'm the one that they let her hey hum, but they never say no. Shut it, can't get enough. One touch might just make it on, just make it on. So, tell me where the love. I'm the one that they let her hey hum, but don't ever say no. Shut it, can't get enough. But yeah, and the song is called One Touch. I forgot to what got to even say what the name was. Did I? Pretty sure I did. Either way. <laughs> but hey, shout out to Delta. Like I say, the sauciest nigga in Ota one of the sauciest niggas in Otaku in the world. I ain't gonna lie. I need to put I need to see more of Delta and everybody else's song. We are on the next level. The end. End up, yeah, this is so to end it off. So to end this off, we got John L featuring Sil Silver Hound with 10,000 hours, the remix and such. And this is for his 20k special. Hey, shout out to you on your 20k, and also big shout out to you for you and Oricadia for y'all album that's about to come out and such. As I can't wait, as I can't wait to react to that album because we already heard one song off of it, which was Cross the Line. So I can't wait for the others, but let's get to this. I can see the light after working so hard I'm determined to conquer my goals Lies and feed the right but the truth lies in honor As soon as I garner control I'll see the future I've been a waiting good come But I'll just work hard every passing And when you see the Tyson Don't you say that I didn't want That boss battle That Tyson 
California I will transform into someone way better Diamond under pressure I will be leagues above the rest So when you ask me if I'd ever settle I'll tell you not until I reach the peak and give a hundred percent This was kind of a little bit different because I remember reacting to the other the original version of it. I think there with Silver Hound since he's like a EDM more person. I see why it's a little. I see why this. He basically goes for those sounds that are like EDM vibes and such. And in a way, he brings out a new like fresh air to it and such for popular songs in nerdcore. As I see that because if I'm not mistaken, Schwabity did like a. You can say a, rem a remix to his like popular Chainsaw Man song, I Want Violence. So, hey, I, I need to see more artists do that and such. Like, in a way, remix, but on the level of like, make it be like an EDM vibe or something. That's all I'm saying. That's what I'm just saying. Y'all that once I come back again, y'all better dance with me and such. Better, better go like. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Better dance it with me when that comes back on. I ain't no coward. Look at the progress that I've made in such little time. You won't make me feel empowered. Have done it without pain, but the end makes it worthwhile. Or sees the future either. Been a waiting good karma, but I'll just work harder and pass it. When you see the times turn, don't you say that I didn't warn ya. I didn't stop till I became someone way better. Overcame my failures, striving to achieve the very best. And, and the thing is with EDM songs and such, most EDM songs they don't really have like a particular. People can just like take up any song and such, right? And just put in like a little EDM song. And I feel like nine times out of ten, when it comes to most EDM songs, I get it that it's a way to like pump up a pump up like a party and all. But here's how I feel, right? Here's how I feel, and because this is the way how I feel how it should be, where it has like a when it comes to the verses, it has like this has like message in it where it gives you motivation and such and it gives you like a good message and such and then when you want to really just let it all out then that beat comes in and make y'all want to dance and such because that way it not only keeps you pumping not only the lyrics itself keeps you pumping up and such but then as soon as when you hear the beat about to come in a way that gives you like that energy where not only you're raving out at a party but also it's like motivation for you to go out and do what you want to do, go set out your goals and all that. So that's how I feel like EDM songs should be like. Way better, my failures, that's just me, but y'all let me know what y'all think. So when you pass me, if I ever settle, I'll tell you not until I reach the peak and give a hundred percent. Oh shit, I thought the peak because that beat was going to come back again. You'll see me climbing the tower My hard work Pays off I wear the crown after 10,000 hours Breathe in Look up You'll see me climbing the tower
Let's go. 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 Now that is how you do a good EDM song right there. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Give you good message in this song. Go be good. But I can't even talk. Gives you good lyrics in the song that makes you feel motivated and then that beat makes you really just want to turn up one time for the one time. As you saw what I just did. So hopefully y'all was turning up the same way how I was. <clears throat> Sorry, bro. <Bert. laughs> with the way how that isn't with the way how the EDM beat was going crazy and such. So either way, hopefully y'all enjoyed this music mayhem and such. And I gotta say, even with the even though we can say with with the way how all these songs were in their own specific way, whether it was talking to the heart, whether it's in aggressive tone or whether it was in an EDM tone, they were all motivation. I don't care. I don't care what y'all say. They were all motivational. Make you pumped up and such. Tell me if I'm wrong. Tell me these don't these songs don't pump you up more. Right? If you wasn't feeling something before that you wasn't in the mood to do something after these songs, they definitely was pumping you up. That's that's how I feel. Cause you saw me dancing and such. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Shout out to everybody on this music mayhem and such. Make sure y'all go subscribe to them. All these are Original link to all of these songs will be down in the description below. So make sure y'all go check it out and run it up and such. But if you made it to the end of this video, comment down below. Pump it up. <laughs> and that makes me know you made it to the end and I give you a little heart. But, been your boy Homer Ziggy signing out. Stay positive. Keep the vibes up. We on the road to 2K because I'm making sure I'm pumped up and such. Check out my other reactions right here. There you go.